let's go over how to void a multi-sheet ballot. By now, you should be familiar with the process for voiding a voter's ballot. This fall, every voter will have at least a two-sheet ballot, two separate pieces of paper. If a voter requests to void their ballot, first ask if they would like to void the entire ballot or just one sheet of their ballot. Both are options. In both cases, the starting steps are the same. On the EPB drop-down menu, touch Void Ballot and search for the voter by entering their birth year and the first four letters of their last name. Then touch Search. Touch the voter's name to highlight it, then touch Void and follow the on-screen instructions. The voter will re-sign for their ballot. If the voter requests to void their entire ballot, place a void label on the top left barcode of both of their old ballot sheets. Place both bags in the red voided ballot envelope and then get a new complete ballot. Scan the ballot stub from the first page, detach it and the other stubs, and hand the voter their new complete ballot. Sometimes, a voter may request to void just one page of their ballot. If this is the case, place one void label over the top left barcode of the ballot sheet that they do not want to use. Place this in the red voided ballot envelope. Get a new complete ballot and scan the ballot stub from the first page. Remove the stubs. Hand the voter the page from the new ballot that they need. Place another void label over the top left barcode of the sheet or sheets they do not need. The voter should have one complete ballot made up of a new sheet and an old sheet. Place all ballot sheets with void labels into the red voided ballot envelope. If you have any questions, please call the help desk immediately.